Why do I believe Islam to be the truth over Christianity? The answer to this is quite simple. Within Islam, there's no struggle to try and explain our Creator. Our Creator does not give us an impossible to solve puzzle in order to figure out who He is. It's quite simple. Say, He is Allah, the one and only, the eternal, absolute. He has no offspring, nor is He born from anything, and nothing is comparable to Him. Within Christianity, it's different. They call it the Godhead, Father, Son, Holy Spirit. The Father is not the Son, the Son is not the Father, the Son is not the Holy Spirit, the Holy Spirit is not the Son, and the Holy Spirit is not the Father. <laughs> but they're all God. Besides that circle of confusion, we have the Christian idea of God contradicting itself. God is all-powerful, all-perfect, all-knowing, all-wise, he's eternal. But in Christianity, God contradicts the idea of all-powerful by being born from the womb of a human woman and becoming a human baby, and then later on becoming a human man. Men are not all-powerful, so that is a contradiction to all-powerful. Then God, or the Son, dies contradicting eternity, because God can't die. Within Islam, we have one author, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, and that Quran has been the same for 1400 years. It has not changed, not once. Allah's word has been perfectly preserved. Then when you look at Christianity and the authors for the Bible, their main source, Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, completely anonymous. They have absolutely no idea who wrote the Gospels. Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John are just cover-up names for authors they don't know. The best they could do is take guesses at who the authors are, but they really don't have a clue. Most of the Bible's authors are anonymous. And the one author they do trust, Paul, claimed that he himself is a liar. This is the ESV Study Bible in Romans chapter 3, verse 7. But if through my lie... God's truth abounds to his glory, why am I still being condemned as a sinner? How can we trust an anonymous source claimed to be the words from God written by men with tons of contradictions and lies? So again, why do I believe Islam to be the truth over Christianity? Because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala does not contradict himself. Because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is al-haq. He is the truth, the absolute truth. Allah is one and only one. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is the most merciful and does not blame me for the sins of one man. The sins I commit are the sins I repent for. I don't repent for anybody else's sins but my own. I am more than blessed to be chosen by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to be Muslim. Alhamdulillah. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bring all of those who are unknowing to the straight path.